This is a new. This is a new one. Hello. <laughs> yeah, it's a little microphone. I mean, cool. think it's the same thing with that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hello. I am That's very awesome. excited. Constantine, I love that show. Uh, I'm so so very happy to have you back. Yeah. So it's, I'm just need to start off that one. Thank you. Thank All you. right. So what can we expect for you on Legends? Oh, I don't know. Look, you drop John anywhere, and he's gonna, you know, stir up some shit. Do you know what I mean? And cause some, cause some trouble. He always brings his own baggage with him and his own complicated issues. And uh, you know, he notoriously doesn't work well with the team. So you know, putting putting him with a team of misfits, which is great. He fits right in. But you know, there's gonna be there's gonna be friction. There's gonna be uh, things going on which will uh, cause conflict and drama. And uh, that's what I love about the character. You put him anywhere, and, you know, something's gonna happen. So, uh, let's see. Um, with Nora, um, it seems like she has a special connection to Ray and then a little bit of struggle between wanting to potentially go light versus dark she has been. Will we explore that? I think, I think so. Nora, I, I really love the character of Nora. She's really close to my heart. And she's had a rough go of it, you know? Both of her parents were murdered. She was put into foster care, and then she was put in, in a mental institution, and then possessed by a demon from 13 years of age. You know, so kind of that darkness is all that she's ever known. And then you, you know, juxtapose that with the extreme lightness and uh, kindness uh, of Ray Palmer, and it's, you know, he's like an alien to her. But, you know, in a way, she's like an alien to him. And I think he's trying to uh, bring out the good in her. And so it's, it, I think what we'll explore, is that, is that possible? Will she stay bad? Will she become a complicated ally for the Legends of Season 6? It'll be exciting, yeah. So what are you both looking forward to now? Of course, you were you know, in the last season, but as regular and joining the team more regular. What are you looking forward to? More oh, awesome season? fights. I just love the <laughs> fights. Do? Oh, God. Don't you? Yeah. I mean, John, Constantine Rick doesn't, oh, you know, he normally, like, in the comic books, he's just getting he's beat up all the time. Do you know what I mean? And he's, like, like, one of those people. Right? But it's I kind cool. of like that. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, it's very Indiana Jones. Same thing happens to him. Exactly. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, I've never thought of it like that. I'm going to oh use, God. I'm going to bring a little it's bit of Indiana Jones reason, into the character. It's the reason why he's one of my favorite, I guess he's not officially a superhero, but why he's a hero to me is because he, uh, you can see that he's afraid, you can see that he gets his ass kicked, yeah. but then he still, you know, he's still the end. Yeah. yeah, he never stops. I never thought about John Constantine he's like Indiana Jones. <laughs> Indiana Jones is my favorite. I know, it's good. Um, but look, I, I'm kind of like, what I'm looking forward to, you know, we've, we've shot the first episode, and I'm looking forward to like working with everyone, you know, it's, it's a, it, everyone has been so great, you know, I, I've not done many guest roles on shows and it's, it's always I always feel that it's difficult you know uh, an established show to come on as an actor and kind of do your thing with a, a tight knit group and, and everyone's just been so welcoming and so lovely and like uh, looking forward to exploring all those different relationships and getting to know everyone and kind of you know getting into the into the into the dirt of it the muck of it you know and like and also like I don't know what they're, they're they're almost quite similar in a way because yeah. you know they're flawed they both they both have a darkness but then yep. I don't know it's, uh, it'll be interesting to see no. what, it'll be interesting you know, to see and if you know if Ray doesn't like you know maybe the dark being influenced more the light being influenced more. I don't know I don't know yeah. I just yeah, made yeah, that yeah. up Are we seeing a I made it up are you a virgin director <laughs> Me? No. <laughs> no. I'm just very, very curious. I have insatiable curiosity and um, I'm very interested in, in, in everything. So that's where that comes out. You talked a little bit about your fights. Yeah. What were some of your most, more difficult stunts that you've ever had to do? Are there this one or this one? Last season, the Berlin episode, uh, I think it was just like fights from start to finish. Um, we had the, oh God. That we, we we jumped into a truck and we were beating people up and uh, in every room possible and there was a car chase and ish and then a wire work that was whew, that, that was rough yeah because they they had a wire harness on and then they strung me up and then they wouldn't let tell me when they were gonna let go so they could get the actual oh wow, oh, wow. You know? yeah yeah and I had been in a bit of a 
fender bender um, being driven to work a couple weeks before that, so I was a little bit banged up, and then and then this up and down is not not so great, but I'm better now, so everything's okay. Sounds yeah. like the extreme. That was the most strenuous. Of yeah, like the, of the roller coaster that like dropped. It, you it, what, my mm. I lost my stomach. Oh. Time. They do it really high. They call, they call they it the whoa. they call it the um, the willies. In the, the in the UK, yeah. So do you know, like when you go on the pirate ship, and as it yeah. as That's it dropped, yeah, like. my mum would say, "Oh, the, you've got the willies." Yeah. Ever, they would call it the willies. No, those screams were real. I was, I was terrified. It's yeah. different for men. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe that's why they call it the willies for men. I don't know. It feels like your balls are in your mouth, right? You're like, ah. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Edit that out. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you guys. Thanks, guys. I was just about to take your phone. You see that? Have a good one, guys. See you.